I've had anxiety since I was a kid. And I certainly didn't have a school where I could go and, and say, well, I'm feeling sad or I'm not sure what I'm feeling. So I didn't have those, I didn't have anything in place that could help me with my anxiety. But I know now that there are schools who do have mentors and they have certain procedures in place for children who are struggling with anxiety from a very early age. Hove Park in Brighton is one secondary school that is prioritising the mental health of its students. There is a specialist team to treat and support pupils in dedicated therapy rooms and all the teachers are trained to spot the early signs of anxiety. I went to school 17 years ago and being popular was important but you guys have the added pressure of social media. Social media basically impacts everything to do with us now. Like you're expected to post like like or nice pictures of you or like like with makeup on yeah, like nice clothes, nice clothes not like in like trackies and but on your Instagram they expect you to have like a really good feed for like everybody else to like that's important isn't it getting likes yeah yeah I think I would say like target grades are a big thing for me it's like oh you should achieve this at this time and then if I don't I'm like well why why didn't I do that because you've worked really hard yeah. right yeah. So is there a pressure to be like that top set end of people? Yeah, because especially now it's year 10, you just feel pressurised to be the best. You just think you're on your own when you're not and it can get hard. Is it nice to know that there's somebody yeah. that you can just say, OK, there's somebody I can yeah, speak to? Because yeah. yeah. it's like if something that you want to talk to, you're like, you've got someone to go to immediately and it's not like you kind of keep it in, you can say it. Because it's not always easy to say, is it? Like if you can say it out loud, that must really help. Yeah. Mm, it really yeah. does, yeah. Definitely. I think yeah. the groups that we have and like uh, people we can talk to, like counsellors and that, that like give someone that doesn't really talk to anyone, someone to talk to and like let it all out, if you know what I mean. Yeah, it feels good to just like, because you know that person's not going to tell anybody else, but yeah. like you keep, you bottle everything up and you finally get to tell someone, which is really good and it feels like refreshing. And it has helped. Yeah. 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 If a young person feels as though they're safe, happy and cared about and have an adult that they can go and speak to about things, then they're far more likely to be comfortable in achieving the school. I suppose prevention is better than cure. Some of these kids, even though they're having issues and worries, they feel like they're going to be prepared to go out into the big wide world and deal with their worries better than if they were not addressed.